Custer again in the corner. Yes. Mitchell back out to Allstore. Allstore back to Custer. Line drive three deep in the right corner. He can do it. His first three is a Raider. That's great execution, Chris. And the Raiders jump out to a 37. -50. Elder High School graduate and Wright State freshman remains in critical condition after suffering a neck injury. And the doctor looked my dad in the eyes and said, Sir, your son is paralyzed from the chest down. I became legally blind, and it wasn't until I was about 26 that I confirmed that I had retinitis pigmentosa. And he said, there's no cure. <laughs> yeah, a lot of brain surgeries, a lot of chemo. Ma'am, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to leave Daddy. I don't want to leave Daddy either, but just remember, it's always OK in the end. And if it's not okay, it's not the end. Voters here in California approve one of the largest scientific endeavors in all of history. In California, voters approve spending $3 billion on stem cell research. We have in our own bodies the cells that know how to regenerate our body. We just need to know how to deliver it or improve it. Stem cell therapies, it will transform medicine as you know it. We will have an era of regenerative medicine that treats many more diseases than we thought. Sickle cell, juvenile diabetes, multiple sclerosis, lupus, heart attacks, Lou Gehrig's disease, AIDS. hepatitis. This research offers the potential to eliminate diseases, literally save millions of lives. OK, who's timing me, telling me when to start? There's a Dr. Fessler that's doing a stem cell research. That's our only hope. I mean, if that, um, if that doesn't happen, then you know, he's like this the rest of his life. I still remember looking down the microscope for the first time to see these results, and I saw the future. I saw something that I never thought I'd see in my lifetime.